Do you want to go back to the lies, the corruption, the trashing of our Judeo-Christian ethics, and an America overrun by people who actually hate our guts? Do you believe in America? Do you believe in the Constitution? Do you believe in a nation with borders? A strong military? Do you respect law enforcement? Do you believe in law and order? Do you put American citizens before those who have no right to be here? That was part of my speech at CPAC's Ronald Reagan dinner last week. What a weekend it was. But I also took a little time to chat with the great crowd there. Take a look. So here we are at CPAC. Nice hat. Thank you so much. Where'd you get that? Party City, and then I made it great again with a sticker that says Trump Pence. Does it come in a bigger size? Uh, it might. It might. <laughs> I am a lifelong Democrat, turned Trump looking, now Republican. Trump uh, thanks to Trump. Did you say Trump looking? Trump looking, now Republican. Did you know that was a word, Trump looking? <laughs> yes, it's, I it's like a that. word now. And guess who I found? A canine. Okay, back to you. All right. Can I ask a question? Okay. My face is very important to me. He's not going to bite me. She's a lover. She's oh, she is a lover. <laughs> So here we are in the press cage at CPAC, and I just was walking out, and I noticed a rather unusual reporter. Uh, hi there. How are you? Good. How old are you? Ten. Ten? Yes, ma'am. Let's say the important thing. Justice Janine writes and speaks the best monologues on TV. She prosecuted Hillary. I didn't Hillary. tell him to say that. I didn't tell him to say that. I really Wait, didn't. Wait, So what drew you to politics? Um, well, I really like watching the debates and the primaries, so that's really what sparked my inspiration for it. Do you think you'll ever run for office? Absolutely not. Why? Because I'm too smart for that. Because why? I'm smart enough not to. Ah, yes you are, and as someone who's run for office five times, you are very smart. So how old are you? I'm 25. You are? Yes, I'm 25. Yeah, you look younger than that. So Thank do you. I. <laughs> Not 25, but younger than my age. Today, it's Trump hats everywhere. That's right. Supporting the president. The conservative movement has really gotten behind the president more and more. What do you tell change. people who don't believe in his agenda? Are they crazy? Do they need medication? I, I'm concerned for their well-being. I think he's doing a great job so far. Um, I think, you know, the speech that he gave today, and he talked about, you know, uh, never letting the American people lose their uh, right to bear arms. He's doing amazing stuff, and he's, uh, all the promises that he's made, he kept. Isn't it amazing a, a, a presidential candidate makes promises and actually keeps them? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know. It's Stunning. great. It's definitely a lot different than we had before. <laughs> L.A. Democrat LA, and C.P.A.C. Yes, in D.C. Yes, yes, and I will yeah. never right. vote Democrat again. Now, why? Tell me why. Because they are unrecognizable. They are anti-American. They are. They can't even stand up and clap for low unemployment in the black and Latino community, low unemployment for women. They um, can't, really? Thank you. I love you. Why did you get that on camera? Okay, I love you. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Feel when you go back to school and there are so many young people, millennials, who are so anti-Trump? Uh, it's a little discouraging, but I'm actually my college Republican chair at my uh, school, mm -hmm. so of course i got to be confident in what I believe in and I have to go out there and, you know, show people that there's a different side of things. And I think a lot of people like to give a stereotype against uh, Republicans or right-wingers or conservatives. She's really good. I like her. Her. Zoe, what do you think of Donald Trump? Give him a kiss. Zoe? Zoe? What do you... Is that the Pledge of Allegiance? Do it again. Do you, do you put your hand on your heart when you do the Pledge of Allegiance? <laughs> I love dogs. I love you. I love her. What's with the message? It's in my way. I know, exactly. 